Many of us would think that it takes years for regular people to be able to call for an autonomous taxi through an app, but I just did. On the screen here, it shows our destination and estimated time. And after I scan this QR code, we're good to go. This is what a company, BB, envisioned the future of taxi to be like. But first of all, autonomous doesn't really mean driverless. According to Chinese law, there has to be a backup driver. He or she will take over if extreme anomalies happen. Our cars are equipped with L4 autonomous driving technologies. As we continue to make our rides safer, we can consider doing away with backup drivers in the future if the law permits. Since I haven't been in an autonomous car before, I admit it's still a bit nerve-wracking to see the driver's hands off the wheel. Traffic light posts in the district are upgraded and can communicate with our cars. We have also installed sensors on the side of the roads to help the cars better navigate. But a rainy day like today is indeed a challenge because water can blur our camera's view and the grip of our ties is also different. We need to continue to improve our technologies.